What's good? What's good, YouTube? What's good? It's your boy Billy the Bodybuilder. First and foremost, before I get into what intermittent fasting really is, do something. See me, man, I've been intermittent fasting for like a year and a half. So I know the results come. When you're when you're consistent, you put in the work. You don't fall for the the tricks and the traps. You be yourself. You set guidelines. You set your timetables. You you know, intermittent fasting is more about discipline than just going head first. A lot of people try to go head first when you try to teach them about intermittent fasting. Like the intermittent fasting I do is a 16A, so I don't eat for 16 hours then i got an eight hour window when i do eat so a lot of people don't get that but then i try to break it down to them it's like bro first and foremost intermittent fasting isn't a diet it's a tool it's a tool to help you not overeat you know because a lot of us tend to overeat and that's why we become overweight and obese because we overeat but if you implement intermittent fasting it's a tool to prevent you from overeating because you only got an eight hour window and if you can eat within that eight hour window you won't overeat because you'll be full by the time that eight hours is through you know what i'm saying so i've been doing it for a year and a half i've gained muscle mass i went from 173 to 186 and it's simply because i broke my meals down between eight hours so i eat four meals typically because my first meal is roughly between 12 and 1 so that's my first meal my next meal is at work it's a snack because i snack at five now my last real meal is at 7 7 30 so typically when i work it's three meals so sorry about that typically when i work it's three meals so it's from either 12 and 1 uh five o'clock and 7 30 so that's three meals but my first meal is always my biggest meal, which I try to get 1,200 calories. And a lot of people look at that like, wow, how can you do that? Because it's not hard. It's really not. People just think it's hard because they don't want to do the bullshit. So they, they say it's hard and they make excuses on why they can't do it. But intermittent fasting has helped me gain muscle mass. I, I'm about to go to the gym. It's 940 right now. I got water right here. But... Intermittent fasting isn't a diet. Diets, to me, are bullshit. Diets, to me, is bullshit because it depends how biblical or religious you are. If you look back in the Bible, they never ate breakfast. You, you know that, right? They never ate breakfast. So, the times we spoke, we y'all claim to eat breakfast is really when you're supposed to be fasting because fasting helps repair your body, replenish cells, give more oxygen to the blood. Y'all don't, you you understand that, right? Y'all Y'all eat it's fucking up your body so i don't eat breakfast i don't i eat like roughly monday through f well, since i work all weekday monday through friday i work 2 to 11 but my first meal is 12 to 1 my next one is 5 and my last one is 7 30 on the weekend saturday and sunday 12 is it 12 2 or 3 5 or 6 then i try to go roughly before 8 o'clock and after that, it's just straight water. It's water or green tea, no sugar. Like, people don't get intermittent fasting, so they fuck themselves up in the long run because they think intermittent fasting is a diet when it's just a tool. Intermittent fasting really allows you to eat whatever the fuck you want. But since I'm not that type of person, I follow my, still follow my regular regimen. So gaining weight for me was much easier doing the intermittent fasting because i knew i had a time restriction and i know i had to get these calories in by that t by a certain time so it benefited for me whether you're trying to lose weight maintain gain it's you break it you break your calories down into an eight hour window you know you break them calories so if you was roughly doing what say two thousand calories right and you knew you only got eight hours, so you got 2,000, so break four meals down to 500. 
the wild. You just got to throw, you just got to throw two thousand calories in, in eight hours. And some people make that hard. That's what a fucking a true diet should be. It shouldn't be six, to seven, eight meals a day. No man, let your body rest, recover, repair because that's when you really gonna see the results. Intermittent fasting isn't a diet; it's a tool. So in the long run. To break it down, intermittent fasting was probably the best thing that ever happened to me. Let me hear y'all's in the comments below. Let's motivate these people and inspire these people to get to an intermittent fasting. Let's go.